An Islamic center at Rutgers University is targeted by vandals. It happened as Muslims observe Eid al-Fitr, the religious celebration marking the end of the holy month of Ramadan. CBS 2's Dave Carlin live at the Rutgers campus in New Brunswick. Dave. The vandalism discovered here by a cleaning crew when that crew arrived at 7.30 and then a leader of this center called police and also took this video. It's Eid morning. And unfortunately, it seems like last night there was a break-in at Silru as well. There's glass everywhere on the floors. They broke something that says MashaAllah on it. A hateful mess greeted those returning on Eid morning to the Center of Islamic Life, or Silru, on the campus of Rutgers University. Cut the TV, a lot of the artwork on the walls. Looks like they ripped the flag from its pole. And then our prayer rooms as well. Officers arrived and needed all the vandalized rooms to themselves for the collecting of evidence. Investigators said the break-in occurred around 4.30 a.m. Wednesday. Here around back is the point of entry with a broken window. Escorting us around the building's perimeter was Saad Edmani, president of the New Jersey Muslim Lawyers Association. The sacred space was desecrated. Art pieces with Quranic verses were destroyed. It's not reflective of my experience at Rutgers. I'm a Rutgers alum, uh, and it, it, this is not, uh, you know, what I uh, felt here on campus. New Jersey Governor Phil Murphy posted on social media that he is disgusted by the incident, and the president of Rutgers University sent out an alert to the campus community, calling this a criminal act of bias and hatred. I got the are you alert. That was terrible. It's a horrible thing to happen that people can't live in peace. It's Eid day, so we still say Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar. God is still greater, God is still greater, God is still greater. There will be a news conference right here tomorrow morning at 11. Live at Rutgers University, New Brunswick. Dave Carlin, CBS 2 News. Okay, Dave, thank you.